Connectivity is critical, it is vital, it is the lifeblood of businesses today. Really, when you think about it, uh, without connectivity, businesses can't operate in the current climate and growing, uh, whether they're talking to customers through social media, they're engaging with their client base, their customer base in online ordering or accessing cloud solutions. It is absolutely vital for the future of any business to operate successfully. GNAS is a concept that we defined about a year ago, and it was the coming together of connectivity, project management and professional services. And what GDAS stands for is Global Deployment as a Service. As businesses seek to expand and look to expand or enhance their overseas operations, what we bring to that particular opportunity is an expertise in working with networks around the world, working with telecoms companies around the world, not just remotely, but we deploy teams to locations around the world, whether that's from Baliman to Bogota, from Istanbul to Inch. We have a capability and expertise built up over the last 15 years to work not only with our own network, but with other telecoms operators' networks to provide a managed professional service. And at this stage, it is a truly global offering that we have. So the question of what is a smart city, there are probably 15 different definitions that I've seen in the last two months about what is a smart city. Really what we talk about is an intelligent city and how you can use technology to address a number of issues. One can be the green agenda, which is looking at sustainability. One can be in terms of the analytics agenda, in terms of marketing data. One in terms of health sectors. There are many solutions to what is a smart city, but really the magnets offering in that sector is around smart and intelligent buildings and making those buildings clever uh, on behalf of developers and building operators. What is it that technology can bring to enhance living, enhance the operating of those buildings, um, the experience of those buildings. So there are many, many definitions, but really what we distill it down to is a smart connected building and how that really supports the construction industry, building operators and residents, tenants within those buildings. At the centre of all smart city strategy really is a smart building, the smart connected environment. We were connecting smart buildings 12, 15 years ago. So taking that forward and developing it, we have an expertise in smart network technology, whether it's Bluetooth, Sigfox, wireless fiber. We then layer in on top of that expertise, the IoT sensors, the intelligence devices such as CCTVs or smart connected fridges. But really the value we bring is the ability to integrate all those devices. But on top of that, bring the intelligence, the analytics to leverage the benefit of all of those technologies and devices, uh, and whether that is in e-health, uh, whether that is in thermostatic control and climate control. So there are really, when we look at it, we are at the forefront of the integration of smart building technology. And if you think smart buildings are at the center of any smart city, without a smart building, you don't really have a smart city. And that's really where we excel.